This video is to explain the bones of the axial skeleton. Highlighted here is the frontal bone. This should be very easy for you to remember because it's the same place as the frontal region. This is the hyoid bone. It's a horseshoe shaped bone on the anterior side of the neck. Um, kind of stands out by itself, so pretty easy to locate. This is the inferior nasal concha, and you can find it on the inside of the skull. The ethmoid bone here is highlighted in green, kind of behind the nose and the eyes. This is the lacrimal bone. It's located in the same place as the lacrimal gland, which is the gland that produces tears. This is the mandible. The mandible is the jawbone. This is the maxilla. I always remember this one because I think Max has a mustache and the bone is kind of where a mustache would be. This is the nasal bone, AKA the nose. This is the occipital bone, should be easy for you to remember, same place as the occipital region. These are the three bones of the inner ear called the malleus, incus, and stapes. This is the vomer, which is the bone that's in between the two nostrils. This is the palatine bone. In this picture, we're looking at the roof of the mouth. This is the parietal bone. This is the zygomatic bone, or cheekbone. This is your temporal bone, kind of where your temples are located. These are your ribs. There are 12 right ribs and 12 left ribs. The first seven are called true, eight through 10 are false, and the last two are floating. This is the sternum, AKA the breastbone. These are the cervical vertebrae. There are seven of them. The first two have special names called the atlas and the axis. These are your thoracic vertebrae. There are 12 of them. These are your lumbar vertebrae. There are five of them. I always remember the vertebrae because I think you have breakfast at seven, lunch at 12, dinner at five. This picture is the sacrum and the cossacks. Thank you for watching.